And what happens is, is that, you know, when you're doing a lot of stuff, there's money going out in different directions, right? Like I even have this sometimes where I'm like, I've got all this money. And then I figure out how to deploy a bunch of it in my gap funding deals or my deals or wherever I decide to put it. And then I'm like, wait a second, I've got, <laughs> where'd all the money go? And then I've got to, you know, get, get money back somehow or get investors involved in some deals and things like that. So, I mean, it, it's, if, if you're doing it right, cash flow is always going to be a struggle because you don't want a lot of money just sitting there not doing anything, right? I make a lot of return on my money, so I figure out how to deploy it. But for those who, who don't have the luxury of getting, that, getting money um, right away because they've got assets or they've got, you know, you know, this or that, I guess you kind of mentioned it is leverage yourself as much as you can with other people. Um, there was another, a uh, couple years later, I had another cash flow issue and I'm like, we had several hundred thousand dollars in the bank. And then all of a sudden we're like dwindling down a little bit. And then I realized that I went through all my projects and I had $10,000 into this project. I didn't realize I didn't have, I had 20,000 in this one. Cause we went over budget on properties and we had holding costs and all this stuff. And I guess a couple, a couple things on that one is I didn't borrow enough money for those deals. So I could have potentially had that money back and not, not stressed at that time that money wasn't there. And then um, the other thing is, is that you need to have metrics in place to track it. So now I, now I have metrics to track how much money I have out into certain deals, certain projects, certain companies, so that I know that if there are, is a cash shortage or I'm getting lower on cash in some different companies, I know where all the money is so I can easily get that money back if I need to. Um, so, you know, people think that when you make it or when you're successful or when you get to a certain point that you're not going to have to worry about money, but, um, you know, I don't necessarily stress as much about money, but there are still times where I have to juggle money in different companies in different places. Cause I've deployed a bunch of money out in different projects and different deals. And I've got, you know, companies that right now during the time that have been hit with, you know, what's going on. And I've got to take money from one company, put it into another to, to, to cash flow certain parts of it. Um, so it's an everlasting, everlasting thing. I feel like for the most part, um, and don't feel bad if you have those issues, that's just, that's just the game, you know, um, you just got to figure out how to play it and, and make it work.